Hi friends, it is so good to see you guys. How are you doing today? My name is Miss Erin and I am having an awesome day so far. We have a great story today that I cannot wait to tell you about. But before we do that, let's take a walk over to our story area. And while you're walking, I want you to make a really sour face. Like you just ate a really sour lemon from our lemonade stand. Like this. <laughs> oh wow, those are some sour faces. Let's take a walk and I'll share my story with you today. Here we are. Today we're learning that God loves us so much that he sent Jesus to be our friend forever. That's a lot of love. But wait, there's more. Nothing at all could separate us from God's love either. It's true. And the Bible verse that we're learning will help us remember how much God loves us. Let's stand up and say it together with the motions. Nothing at all can separate us from God's love. Romans 8, 39. Let's say it again together. Nothing at all could separate us from God's love. Romans 8, 39. See, God loves you a lot. Who loves you? God loves you. Yes, God loves you and everyone in the whole world so much that he sent his son Jesus to be our friend forever. Well, now it's time for my favorite part of the day. Can anyone guess what time that is? That's right, it's time for worship. Now I wanna see all your best moves today, okay? So get up on your feet and get ready to worship.
Hey friends, welcome to the clubhouse. It's me, Poppy, and I'm so happy to see you. We had such a busy morning here at the lemonade stand. So many of my neighborhood friends came by to get lemonade. First, it was Miss Amelia from down the street. She's so sweet, she got a cup of lemonade. Then, it was Doug from the street over. He was super thirsty after his ball game. Then, it was Dr. Veronica. She came by after taking care of sick people, but she really liked my lemonade. It's been an amazing day. I just love seeing so many of my special friends. Who? Who? It's Ollie. Hello, Poppy. Who? Who? Did a lot of friends come by to see you? Hey, Ollie. Yes, so many amazing friends came by the lemonade stand today. It made me so happy. I just love seeing all my friends. Seeing friends is great. It's true. I have a story about a very special friend for you. Just listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through who? Oz got a Bible story for me and you. Ah. Hola, friends. I'm Luis. This lemonade my friend Poppy gave me is really good. That reminds me of someone who gave us something even better. Let me tell you the story. Do you want to help me build it? Great. Let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer. Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now we just need our story tools. We have everything we need. Okay, so today's true story from the Bible begins with God. And how he loves us with his whole heart. This is the world. God loves everyone in the whole wide world. You could live here, or over here, or even here. Yep, God loves everyone. God loves everyone so much that he gave us a very special gift. Now, it wasn't a new bicycle. It wasn't a cute fluffy puppy. Do you want to hear what the special gift is? <laughs> Jesus! God loves the world so much, he gave us Jesus. Wow! <laughs> Let's say that together. Can you repeat after me? God loves, God loves the world so much, the world so much, he gave us, he gave us Jesus. Jesus, <laughs> that's right. God loves the world so much, he gave us Jesus. Jesus is special because Jesus is God's son. And drum roll please. That's right. Jesus wants to be my friend forever, and Jesus wants to be your friend, and your friend, and your friend. <laughs> God loves you so much, he gave you Jesus. Hey, Ollie, tell me, who loves you? God loves me. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who loves you? God loves me. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Adios. So there's your story. It's all true. God gave us Jesus to be our friend, and he will be our friend forever. Ho, ho. Thanks, Ali. Goodbye to you. Ho, ho. What a great story. God loves us so much. He gave us Jesus to be our friend forever. Wow. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it, get it. 
Good. I had such a good time today seeing so many special friends, but no one's a better friend than Jesus. Well, I've got to go soon. I know more people will be coming by. See you next time. Bye. Today we're going to make a list of people that God loves. So right now I want you to pause this video and go and find a journal that you have or even just a piece of paper and a marker or a crayon and think of someone that you want to write down in our prayer journal. It could be anyone from your mom or your dad to a neighbor or a friend. So go ahead and pause this video and start writing friends. Wow friends, those are some great lists. I am so proud of you for writing down so many names. Let's pray and lift those lists up to God together. Dear God, thank you for loving us so much that you gave us Jesus to be our friend forever. Thank you for loving every person we wrote down on our list and everyone else in the world. We know that you love and care for us and all of our friends, our families, and neighbors. We thank you for that. You really are the best. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, Epic Kids, thank you so much for tuning in to this week's episode of Epic Kids Online. Now, parents, you get to take over from here. We've attached a parent guide on our website just for you so that you and your child can follow along with today's super duper fun activities. There you'll find all the resources that you need to finish today's services in an interactive way. We want you to know that we are praying for each and every one of you every single day. And we can't wait until we all meet back at the Epic Kids headquarters again. Remember kids, you have the power to make every day an epic one. So until next time, have the best week ever. See you later Epic Kids.